It's time to spin the wheel. Round and round it goes. And when it stops, I think I know. Hello. Minimus, oh, my number so hard. Da, da, da. Got, gotta get it, gotta get it good. Oh, oh, baby, come on. Yep, this is what we're doing. So if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe today, dinosaur fans. We are doing this. Oh, yes. Welcome, and today we are going to be drawing the Mimasaur, and I'm doing a few rough drafts, and I'm doing this for the fans in the community that left messages from last year about what things to draw, and I'm responding to most of the comments, and I spin the wheel, and I'm just doing some of the arts that I picked out that would seem more doable. So I am practicing with a turtle head and some detail, and I'm liking it so far. And the week has been very busy with me and to share some updated stuff I'm trying to do some test draws and you gotta think of turtle's body without a shell when drawing one of these uh, it does take shape and a lot of practice I messed up on the leg there just touch that up and when you're drawing you try to think really animalistic what kind of animals anatomy and certain things um, usually you draw certain shapes or tones or circles mostly circles and shapes to start off with this is pretty interesting it's almost bird like mostly dinosaurs are related to that but this is more i think more turtle like when it's coming to a four-legged dinosaur sometimes but we're just doing the details now. This is like gonna be the final one. I decided to use some Adobe Elements here. I just switched it over really quick because I had two different windows open. So we're just gonna get this down and I'm doing this detail as fast as I can. I appreciate all of, I appreciate all of you here and to listen to me in my anime form. Um, I am working on a lot of projects and I'm going to add some grass and some wonderful, wonderful trees. It's going to make it look a little nice and we're going to get some grass in the background here. Get a little water there and some sand. Get some more trees. Make it really nice for all of you and I'm going to use some green make it so it stands out. I would go black and white. Now we're going to be using some Adobe effects as well. I'm going to do some overlay colors. Make it a little easier with the coloring. Some ripples. Now, don't worry, it's going to look good when I'm done. You can get all these wonderful browns and scaly effects for the scales. I mean, I don't have uh, much scale effects I'm going to use with this element. We use the sand. Back that up a little messy. I don't want it to look too yellow. It's still too dark. I just got to you know, find that right tone with a computer. And just get that all in. It's a little cartoony, I know, because I'm an animation artist and I love comic book design. So just getting all this in here, some spots, some detail, like a dinosaur, getting a nice red tongue or pinkish, some blue sky, yes, and we got all that blended in, um, get some clouds, make it really nice, and some grass there, and you can you got moon, sun, and some stars, and some black dots over everything. <laughs> But hey, it's what it is, and just get finished a lot of these details on shines and glares. And yep, that toning looks a little off, but I'm gonna try to fix that toning a little bit. Get some of this in, some special effects now. Ooh, that's a little grayish. I like it though, but maybe another time. My name, there we go. And then now save it. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna name it directly this name. Save, and there he goes, the Mimisaur. Beautiful. Now the glamour shots. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and hit that thumbs up and have an awesome day. Keep cool! Bye!